Hey YouTube, um, thanks for uh, joining me on my second video. Uh, today I'm going to discuss why your Raspberry Pi isn't booting up. Now, I've had these problems a lot of times, okay? So, the biggest problem is your SD card. You think, okay, I'm gonna, let, me, let me just go on eBay and order a cheap one. A generic one that that looks like this or like this well these ones are good for a phone not a Raspberry Pi because most likely they're not compatible with Linux you always want an SD card that's compatible with Linux so you're gonna have to bite the bullet and go out and get a good one now, it doesn't have to be an ultra or a super, super fast one. It's just got to be compatible with Linux. So, I just went to Costco and picked up a, a SanDisk Ultra. Now, it doesn't have to be SanDisk. It can be Kingston or whatever. And it doesn't have to be ultra. It can just be the plain old uh, regular one like this. This works just fine in your Raspberry Pi. Because in your Raspberry Pi, it's only uh, got to be a class 4. But it's very hard to find those anymore. So, yeah. If your Raspberry Pi is not booting, you're just getting the black screen. Change the SD card. Go out and get a brand name SD card. The generic ones don't work. I've had no luck with the generic ones. And I got a, a 32 gigabyte uh, brand name, and that, that's plenty of space. Um, so the final verdict is, is that if your Raspberry Pi is not working, not booting, and you've put an image on to the SD card, go out and get a brand name SD card. Not one of these plastic, cheap, generic ones, okay? Thanks. If you like the video, please hit the like button. Having that, thank you for watching.